okay i am using uh, an example here uh, you don't have to understand what this code actually does first all right i'm just using this code as an example so of course uh, you must always remember well uh, to change your runtime okay and uh, do a connection all right so make sure you are already connected okay now we are very used to just go into the runtime and just run everything and when you run everything run all it will run all the code from the top down one by one all right uh, but you don't always have to do this right? you can actually run section by section okay which i'm going to show now right? so if you want to run only a section there is this run over here which you can just run only this cell right so when you run this uh, when you see there is a check mark means that it is run and it is completed so you can actually run uh, cell by cell okay so this one is to mount okay then this one is to uh, read all right and this one is to do the printout all right so not everything has a printout so this one has a printout okay uh, of course i will explain this when the times are uh, when we reach the chapter all right now of course some of the question will be why would i want to run cell by cell instead of run everything okay i'm going to show something here now all right uh after i run this section okay let me run this one here. All right, this one is done. I can see the check mark here. This one is done. The rest I haven't run. See, they are not executed yet, but I want to display it again. See what happened. So I can rerun a cell uh, not in sequence. All right, not in sequence, not in a top down sequence okay i can rerun any cell i want or i can skip certain cell depending on what i actually need all right and this will give you some greater flexibility on when you are actually uh working with collab 